I got into photography when I was a lad and I used to go a lot, do a lot of walking, uh, climbing in the, in the Peak District, in the Lake District. Um, I used to use the camera to record those trips. And so my love of the landscape really started there and the photography just progressed and developed and eventually the photography became um, more and more important and the walking less and less important and uh, so in the end I was quite happy to do a day's photography and, and walk a mile or so um, and, uh, and so really that's how it all started. I'm Chris Upton. I'm a travel and landscape photographer from the UK. I've been fortunate to visit some incredible locations around the world and have experienced them at the best time of the day. I often feel it's a privilege just to be there, to drink in the atmosphere and connect with my subject. And for me, photography is all about enjoyment and emotion. And the camera is a tool to record those experiences, not to get in the way or detract from them. I want to minimize the choices in order to be able to concentrate on the creative process the one thing that the camera cannot do for me. What I like about this composition is the lovely S shape in the waterfall as it meanders down here over the rocks. And uh, that will look lovely with um, a longish shutter speed. So let's take the picture. Simplicity is the key and there's a liberating feeling, a freedom and pure enjoyment from using this camera. Yeah, I'm looking for shapes in the rocks, shapes with the water. This is great, isn't it, with this camera? You know, I don't really need the bag. It's just a couple of filters in my pocket, batteries, a camera like this, and you're, and you're off. I think with the X100F, because it's so small, portable, it, it's much more conducive to handhold. The Fujifilm X100F is a beautifully designed camera. It's a fusion of retro, classic good looks, incorporating modern high-tech. It's intuitive to handle and produces great image quality. It's not easy, particularly if you're a, a committed zoomer, but um, it can be done. With its 23mm focal length, giving a similar field of view to our own eyes, the X100F features a great general purpose lens, not too wide, not too long. If you want a closer or wider view, then you need to use your feet. I think the key really to, well, to any photography is to leave the viewer in no doubt what message you're trying to give them. I think people don't like to look at a picture and then, well, what's it all about? Well, what's he trying to say? The X100F features the same 24 megapixel sensor as in the X-T2 and X-Pro2. One of the things that I like to do is to shoot square and Whilst I can crop the image afterwards, one of the things that helps me is to change the viewfinder from 3 to 2 format to square. I said you'd need wellies. <laughs> you, you do know when you've got one that you think has got something, it's that something extra, be that special light or just the composition um, that, that just seems to work. I think the best camera is the one that you have with you. And if you want a classic to pop in your pocket and take anywhere, that's really a joy to use and be confident that it's going to deliver you excellent results, then this is the camera for you. In 2011, Fuji introduced the X100. That range of cameras have been a perfect companion for my wedding and street photography ever since. Even though I'm a professional wedding photographer, I also use the camera for all of my personal and family photography. Over the last six years, almost every important image to me has been shot on an X100. The X100F is so light, so portable and so discreet. And now with a tactile ISO dial and clever control ring, I have everything I need to shoot at my fingertips. The X100F is a camera I can take anywhere with me. I've recently used it on the streets of London and New York. It's great to just be able to have the camera in one hand and blend into the environment while shooting. Thank you.
There's the option to choose between an electronic viewfinder, giving me a perfect reproduction of the image I'm about to make, or the optical viewfinder, with its bright frame lines, allowing me to see a much wider context of the scene. For me, the most important thing about photography is enjoyment. I have to love what I'm doing. Fuji have created a whole range of great cameras with the X-Series, and these are part of the reason I enjoy photography so much. Whether I'm photographing a wedding, shooting my own children, or simply wandering around London, I need to have a camera that I love using. Six years ago, the X100 was a classic. Now, in 2017, the X100F, with its larger sensor, Acros film simulation, directional joystick, and incredible high ISO control, builds on that legacy. For me, the X100F is the perfect street and social documentary camera. I've always been smitten by Fujifilm's X100 series camera. The new X100F is perfect for both landscape and documentary photography. It combines both portability and versatility with Fujifilm's now renowned image quality. The X100F offers exceptional low light performance with minimal noise even at a high ISO. The image exposure compensation has also been increased to plus or minus five stops for additional versatility. In the studio, I am able to employ the new cutting edge 24 megapixel X Trans 3 sensor with the on camera film simulations, which now includes ACROSS for capturing high contrast mono images. The X100F features the ability to charge over USB, making it great for traveling light. Focus selection has also been much improved thanks to the inclusion of a focus thumbstick. The 23mm, 35mm equivalent focal length can be supplemented by both additional lens attachments or by the newly added digital teleconverter. It's the portability and performance of the X100F that make it such an attractive camera for everyday use. It is just as much at home capturing the streets of Belfast as it is performing in the studio. It's in the outdoors where I'm most comfortable and capture the majority of my images. The Fujifilm X100F, like all of its predecessors, is a loyal companion through the forests and on to the higher peaks of County Downs Moor Mountains. ISO adjustment has been moved to a physical dial. This, combined with a hybrid and electronic viewfinder, make shooting and ever-changing light levels notably easier. The Fujifilm X100F retains the ability to capture sweet panoramic images, producing a single JPEG file that is automatically stitched on camera. The X-Trans 3 sensor with stunning dynamic range offers the ability to capture the highs and lows of the Northern Ireland landscape. The Fujifilm X100F also features a T mode of up to 30 seconds and a bull mode combined with a shutter release cable offers the ability to capture extremely long exposure images. The threaded lens offers the use of additional ND filters to enhance the long exposure experience. The versatility of the Fujifilm X100F continues with built-in wireless for both mobile transfer and geotagging of images, but the key attraction to me is the combined versatility of portability and image quality. 
The X100F sees an exciting new chapter in the X100 story, perfect for travel, for documentary and for landscape. Mine goes, well, everywhere. Everywhere.